God says, but I will show you whom you should fear. Fear him who, after your body has been killed. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. But the cowardly, the unbelieving, the vile, the murderers, the sexually immoral, those who practice magic arts. Then I will tell them plainly, I never knew you. Away from me, you evildoers. For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. And they will go out and look on the dead bodies of those who rebelled against me. The worms that eat them will not die. The fire that burns them will not be quenched. If your hand causes you to stumble, cut it off. It is better for you to enter life maimed. And throw them into the blazing furnace, where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. He will cut into pieces and assign him a place with the hypocrites, where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. And throw that worthless servant outside into the darkness, where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. They will be punished with everlasting destruction, and shut out from the presence of the Lord and from the glory of his might. They will drink the wine of God's fury, which has been poured full strength into the cup of his wrath. In Hades, where he was in torment, he looked up and saw Abraham far away, with Lazarus by his side. Then he will say to those on his left, Depart from me, you who are cursed, into the eternal fire prepared for the devil and his angels. The wicked go down to the realm of the dead, all the nations that forget God. Whoever remains stiff-necked after many rebukes will suddenly be destroyed without remedy. Those who are far from you will perish, you destroy all who are unfaithful to you. Enter through the narrow gate, for wide is the gate and broad is the road that leads to destruction. They call to the mountains and the rocks, fall on us and hide us from the face of him who sits on the throne and from the wrath of the Lamb. For our God is a consuming fire. Support our community and donate us through super thanks. In a similar way, Sodom and Gomorrah and the surrounding towns gave themselves up to sexual immorality. Kiss his son or he will be angry and your way will lead to your destruction for his wrath can flare up in a moment. Blessed are all who take refuge in him. Dear God, I come before you today seeking courage and strength. Life can be challenging, and at times I feel overwhelmed and afraid. I ask that you fill my heart with courage, that you remove any doubts or fears that hold me back. Help me to face my challenges with bravery and confidence, knowing that you are with me every step of the way. Give me the courage to step out of my comfort zone, to take risks, and to pursue my dreams. When I feel weak, remind me of your presence and grant me the strength to persevere, Lord. Grant me the courage to stand up for what is right, to speak truth, and to act with integrity. Support our community and donate us through super thanks. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.